legends welcome back beer reviews with the beer sarge <coughs> new neighbors now i don't think i need two with harleys doing burnouts in their garage to celebrate the fact they moved into a new house right all emotions aside Jucifer. I saw this and I thought, oh, now, number eight do a bloody great hazy IPA. So it's a 6.6% .6 beer. We all know what 666 means. Raise the horns. Right, so it says here on the side, this hazy collection has been conjured up from the nether realms by the brewers collaborating with unseen forces to concoct an unholy brew using the diabolical power of Belgian yeast, we have battled with the underworld of hops to make a beer worthy of selling your soul for. Well, being a bit of an Iron Maiden fan, just a tiny one, I thought, if I don't grab this 666, I'm going to regret it. So I'm now ready to put Jucifer into a glass. Now, I'm using this Three Sisters glass because these glasses seem to really show off the hazy IPAs because they funnel all the aromas up so that when you're taking a drink, you get the aroma as well. So, without further ado, let's throw Jucifer into a glass. Initially, look at that. So it's a it's a very light coloured sort of a lemon sort of colour. That's the colour I'm getting in the light. It might be different. It might be all the bloody rubber smoke that's sitting in the air that's causing the. Oh great! There's another one. Fix your fucking exhaust. But anyway, there we go. Look at that. So we've got like a. Yeah, it's a, it's sort of a, it's not a deep colour, it's a light sort of colour, but uh, yeah, looks good. Alright, it's a bit of a sniff with air, we have a sniff. Oh. I kind of get cat pee, but I don't think the cat's been around here. I kind of get cat pee. Um, yeah, I'm not getting much more than that. All right, let's have a taste. Let's hope it doesn't taste like cat pee. Oh, it's very bitter. Bitter. I'm getting bitter with a like a quite a sour note in there as well. So it's almost like it's um yeah, it's almost like a combination of it, it, it's like a sour, but it's not it's, it's not super sour. It's kind of a cross between a um. Kind of a cross between a sour and um, a salty sort of flavour. So we had that one, that one of those Aussie ones that was a centre cross um, that was a um, was brewed with salt water. This is kind of a. It feels like this might be right down the centre between a uh, sort of a salty, briny sort of um, taste and a sour. Now, sours are just fucking, they're not very good, but. This is sour, and I don't know. It says juicifer. It's not, it's not like an orange juice. It's not a, it's a, it's a very different IPA. I don't think I've ever tasted one like this at all. Um, 
not horrible it's not horrible but it's it certainly doesn't have that full punchy fruity boom you know yeah it doesn't have that it doesn't have that um, that you'd normally get from a, a, an IPA especially a hazy IPA um, and it's 6.6 .6. it's it feels watery like it feels like it doesn't have enough body in it it doesn't it doesn't yeah, it doesn't do it for me this is a hazy IPA that is not uh, yeah it's not it's not really something that I'd buy again it's uh, it's a bit yeah it's a bit disappointing and then considering its name there we go Jucifer hazy IPA um, not a lot of body to it it's not very substantial. All right, catch you later.